Good morning, fine folks. Uh, got my tomato plants in for a couple of weeks now, and they're doing well. We had to cover them a couple of times because of freeze and frost, and uh, several got hit, but we replanted, and uh, you have to uh, include that because that's possible every season. So that's why we grow extra plants. And we give them away as well to our friends and neighbors. Anyway, I'll share with you what's going on in the garden. We got mostly everything transplanted. We have Swiss chard coming up here, green beans. I think there's some cucumbers in there as well. One plant was originally a cucumber bed, but they got wiped out with the uh, freeze. Lettuce and spinach. Over here we have melons and squash and tomatoes and zucchini and they're doing well uh, melons cantaloupes and watermelons awesome for you cucumbers amazing for you as well and they're doing well wood for next winter and uh, this is just a little bed with some garlic and onions and I have some wheat grass growing here I'm letting come to seed and uh, that's good in smoothies or even just to make a yourself a green little uh, drink in the morning put it in the blender with some water and just make a shot of it good for you more tomato plants, garlic's coming well, radishes have to be harvested, green beans are doing well, everything's doing great. So, and it looks like it's going to be a fine hot day out here today. It was cold last night, cold this morning, early. Okay folks. Yeah, this is the greenhouse. Uh, we were putting new windows in the house and we had all these old windows and screens and this used to be a dog pen, an old dog pen. So I told my husband, why not just utilize them and make a greenhouse? And sure enough, that's what he did. He's amazing. Same with the pergola. All I did was draw a picture because the yard was so uneven and water, when it rained, would settle right here. So uh, we got all the stone nearby and uh, that, was, that was quite a job, hauling all that stone. Pergola is beautiful at night. He really did an awesome job. We have wisteria growing on it, and we did have grapevine. We took that off because it just uh, was overpowering it. But uh, we have not even an acre here, and we try to utilize it as much as we can. We've added new garden beds, new plants, bushes. Um, we have raspberries and blueberries and strawberries. Don't have to eat at their table all the time, although sometime we do. Well, we try to get away from it. Anyway, you folks have a nice day. I've got uh, some weeding to do here in the yard. And uh, I'll keep you up posted. I'll keep you posted and it really looks different uh, when everything's greened up. Okay, folks, you have a good day.